Strange. Let's get right on to it. Episode 2, baby. Let's go. Quite episode one. That's why I'm so cute now. Sherry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. I'll get the tests and papers to you this afternoon. I'm Ow! Wait, what? Where did I go? Did I go here? Oh. Oh, please don't show anything. Oh, Jesus Christ, I'm about to get the monitor's eyes. Hey, Max. Hey, Kate. How are you doing? I'm here. Thanks again for standing up for me yesterday. I needed that. Anytime. That guy has issues. Doesn't everybody here? By the way, Max, do you still have my copy of the October Country? Oh, yes, of course. It's great so far. I didn't realize Bradbury was such a poet. Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? I just need to take some notes for class. Absolutely. I'll bring it by later. Please say skip. Please it. Please say it'll skip to it.
Oh god. Okay. Just to show in the face. Oh fuck. What's up, Kate? School. That's it? That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. Victoria, that wasn't me. Oh my god, right. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> you're going to be sorry someday. Oh, boo-hoo. I'm sorry you're a viral slut. I'm sure she had fun. Looks like it. I know Nathan hooked her up, and you know he has the good shit. Preach it, sister. Yup, I still have goddamn paint all over my face. Good thing my faithful minions took their sweet time bringing me a towel. We ran all the way- Give it a rest, Taylor. Now I know if I'm in an accident, I won't rely on you or Courtney for help. You can hang out with Kate, or Max. She's a weirdo with that dumb camera. I hate that I'm so quirky crap. Anyway, let's leave the link to Kate's video so everybody gets a chance to see her in action. You are such an evil biatch. I love it. I better get dressed then go give back Kate's book. Oh, I could get dressed. No fucking way. This is not why I came to Blackwell. And I still have to clean all this crap up after I find Kate's book. Maybe I'll just put on a shirt and jeans. Hey, Einstein had the same exact suit for every day of the week. And he couldn't even rewind time. Okay. What's up? My desk is a pigsty, but I know it ain't there. What am I looking for? I was not paying attention. Uh, no book here. I was looking for a book. What kind of book? What are you looking for? Uh. Man, this could almost be art if it wasn't so fucking sick and disturbed. There's nothing. Nothing up here. Bro, what? Uh. And nothing here. <sighs> of course she just spilled soda on Kate's book. We better fix this fast. Kate needs the book, and I don't want to add to her list of problems. Maybe I can rewind? Yeah, this is necessary. Please. Be gone, foul soft drink. Aha, you sneaky book. You're mine. Okay. I got the book. Now, now I can finally take this back to Kate before I'm late. As okay. if I have to worry about being late anymore. I do have all the time in the world now. 
Kate. Is this Kate's turn? No, that's Brooks. Kate. Yeah. Kate? You in there? Yes, I'm here. Come in, Matt. Hey, Kate, I brought your book. Max, why did you step in between David and me yesterday? I hate bullies. David Madsen should know better. I was hoping he would, but it's nice to see that you care about me. Kate, I actually do care. So what's the story with you and David? Well, he's a total paranoid ass. He thinks I'm part of the Vortex Club. Yeah, right. Why does he think that? Because he saw the video. You know how humiliating this is for me? I know this sucks, Kate, but tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I have no memory of it. It doesn't sound like you. I can't see you partying with Victoria. I didn't. You have to tell me more than that. What happened at the party? Did you drink? I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine. And then I drank water. Are you sure it was just one sip? I take a sip at church, and I don't end up on a viral video, okay? Did somebody drug you? I remember... I remember getting sick and dizzy. Go on. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Nathan Prescott? Oh, shit. He was being nice for a change when he offered to help me. He's the opposite of nice. What next? All I recall is driving for a long time. Then I woke up in a room. I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck. And... And... And? That's all I remember. I don't know what happened. I woke up outside my dorm room the next day. I didn't have any marks or bruises, but I felt gross. So, who took the video of you at the party? I have no idea. Probably Victoria. She was there being her mean self. Jesus, Kate. I'm sorry. This is serious shit. How do I get a viral video taken down? I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need to know what to do. Kate, we'll figure it out. I'll check back later, okay? Thanks, Max. You can put my book here near my bag. What did she say? In her bag? I'll put the book in your bag. So, Max, can I ask you a question? And please be honest. Absolutely, Kate. Anything. I need to find out if Nathan Prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. Should I go to the police? If you do that, they won't believe you. You're on video grabbing at all those guys and they'll use that against you. Bad. But I know I was drugged. That's what you have to prove, not them. I'm just telling you how the cops in school will look at this. The video doesn't exactly back you up. You make me feel so hopeless. No, no, Kate. I just don't want you to get hurt anymore. That seems impossible at this point. So that's your answer? I, I think we should wait. There are other things going on that might help you. But not right now. So I can walk down the halls with people calling me a viral slut. Thanks, Max.
Because you have no proof. Good job, Dr. Max. She didn't like what I had to say, but we need more proof of what happened. Exactly. Don't quit, quit being nosy. Alright, what's my next assignment? Playing my game. What the hell? What? Streaming right now. Oh, that's your new power. Or have you gone back in time? You figured it out. I can't, can't go that far, smart ass. I need your help. Like when you told Step Dork it was your weed. But for real, so we need to talk. I don't know. Oh, yeah. One. Let us one. I don't know. Alright, eat and ass buster breakfast at, at two. At two whales. Like that. I guess. I don't know. I'm trying to fuck this up right now. So, is it good to have minions? Got a bail master breath. Got a veil master, breakfast is a go. You there, Mad Max? Like I said, always for you. No emoji, sad emoji. Meet me at dinner in 40. I'm just reading the text messages and stuff. I'll be there, do not be late or, or I don't know, time is not on your side. Don't get high like in my room on my way. You are evil. 40 minutes or else. Max, food, two whales. See you there. Don't hurt your fingers texting. Yay, breakfast. No emoji. Oh, Jesus Christ. Even with all this crazy shit going on, it is so cool having Chloe back in my life again. Like, no time has passed. Well, I'm not supposed to do exit the building. Hang on. Oh, mother. Hey honey, I hope you didn't forget to water the plant we gave you, but don't drown it either. Oh, what the fuck? Okay. Private number? Keep your smart mouth shut about everything, or I'm coming for your ass. I know where you sleep. Who the fuck is this? Damn. I report that to the oh, shit. Now I'm getting anonymous threats? It never ends. This has to be from Nathan. Oh. But it could be anybody. I better be doubly careful around here, or I could be in serious danger. Yep. If I'm not already. <laughs> oh, boy. God dang. Is that it? For that, ain't it, right? Wait, what? There ain't no way that's all of episode two. No, there's no way. That's, that's strange, bro. Mm -hmm. Wait, that's it? That's all of episode two? Uh, nothing. I don't... There's no way that's all of episode two. There's no way. 
Is that it? Seriously? Oh my god, that's it. You know what? That wasn't much. Okay. Episode 5. It's the dark room. Okay. Oh, seriously, I don't feel like that's all. I feel like there's more to it. Alright, episode three underway. In the previous episodes of Life is Strange. Whoa. They call film little pieces of time. Because Max wants every Guys, this is episode three. Chloe would be all over this. So I better get moving. What's going on? I still can't stop thinking about Kate. It's like I'm awake in a bad dream. Oh boy, she's about to get kidnapped. Okay, this is scary dark. Let there be... What the hell? What is this? Hey Dana, how are you doing? I just can't stop thinking about Kate, and if this is my fault too. Uh, I, I knew she say. was depressed, but I had no idea how bad. Must be serious to throw yourself off the roof. So why do you think she was on the roof in the first place? Maybe Kate was so ashamed she got wasted on that video. I don't blame her, but it she was She killed herself? Gross. Come on. You really believe that Kate Marsh wanted to get drunk at a Vortex Club party? So what exactly are you saying, Max? Does this have something to do with why you got suspended yesterday? Tell me the truth. It's complicated. I don't want to drag you into this, okay? Not yet, anyway. I'm getting scared now. But people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like, who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sherlock? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. I'll see you later. Ah, oh, Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time. 
going through her shit. Oh. So Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. In front of the main hall. I know I have a set of keys on me somewhere. Principal ah, Wells. Oh, are you serious? I'm, I'm toast if he sees me. Nobody can expel me. Oh. The most magical insight. Burn bright. In the hall? Okay. Now I understand why the students call this place Black Hell. Principles here. Is there a way I can distract them? Wait, is there like something I missed? What could I do? <laughs> I don't know what to do. Did I go through Victoria's stuff? I'm sitting my ass down. Nobody. Oh, great. He saw me. Maybe I could sneak by when he was trying to open the door. I know I have a set of keys on me somewhere. Ah, Max the ninja strikes again. I'm sitting my ass down. I thought, I thought she. I thought I got caught. She didn't get kidnapped. Booyah! I didn't feel get it. So I get Booyah! Scared. Like I'm a scary punk ghost. Well, like a scary and sensitive asshole. Chloe, I watched my friend jump off a roof today. I don't think you need to yeah. prank me tonight. You always trip out on me for not being there for you, but is this how you're there for me? I'm. I'm sorry, Max. I, I wasn't even thinking. I suck. I'm not trying to be a bitch, but I'll never get the image out of my head of Kate jumping off that roof. All because my power didn't work. It didn't mean shit. I know seeing Kate fall was horrible. I don't even know how to deal with that, so I just act like an idiot. But it's your badass power that's gonna bring all this to a close. We just need to connect the players. And find out who really killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? I hope so, Chloe. But how? Snow and Eclipse are bad omens. This whole town is a bad omen. And notice that Blackwell seems to be ground zero. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. I mean... I even got my own dumbass suspended. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? Right. For one thing, there's too much coincidence between the people around Kate and Rachel. Like Step Prick and Nathan Prescott? Of course. They're both sociopaths. More like psychopaths. At least David doesn't try to beat down women like Nathan. 
And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... Alive? I have to think that, Chloe. Her spirit is so powerful here. Maybe too much power. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, step prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? You're suspended anyway, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. Oh god. What's about to happen? Thank you again so much for helping me put together a portfolio. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted. As you know, it's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day, and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I imagine uh, you're pretty upset over Kate as well. I'm like still in shock. I've never seen anybody die. I really cared about Katie. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... Are you fucking kidding me? when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. Chloe the Keymaster. You know it. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. Not to mention the weed you brought into my room. Joking. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? They can't charge us for just entering. I'm serious. We could go to jail. Not if I'm related to the head of Blackwell security. Step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. Tell that to Kate. Come on. One more door and our work here is done. Is there a way to shut this door? Can't shut the door. That's it. the fuck? The security officer should have the key to the principal's office. He's hiding shit, like everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door open. Believe it or not, I know a little about lockpicking, thanks to Frank. I might as well test out my thief skill. Go for it. We're already in this deep. Well, you could look for the key, just in case. 
Why, yes, I could. Dead end. Boring. No keys here. Maybe on a shelf. Nothing to see here. Desolation. Total phony would wear a crappy hat like that. Nothing here. No key for thee. We have to find another way in. Guess I didn't spend enough time with Frank. But I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. Hey, Warren, you busy? Just bubble hearth, you'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. Without naming names, if somebody had access to the art and science labs and wanted to construct a device that would, say, open a locked door, would you maybe kinda know how? Huh? No, I'm just asking for fun. Thanks, science guy. Uh, no, 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 stay. We need you as backup. Just send the text instructions now. I'm sorry, I'm just not sure about a movie night right now. Don't hate me, and thanks for the help. This sucks ass! Goddamn door! Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell! Sorry, Max. I got nothing. What about your plan? I'm gonna go put it together. Can you stay here and not get caught? I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. See you soon. Warren is such a classic nerd. Let's see if I can find those items. No can here. Nope. Doesn't anybody drink sodas here? What do you know? Trash. Looks like that was a drawer, I'm not gonna lie. Just emptied. Nothing here. Where'd it go? To search. Oh, that's the bins. A long time ago, in a girl's room right here. Nothing in it. here. Yeah. Gross. I hate that formalin smell. Only a B minus? Warren has shattered my faith. Of course, I'm barely passing science. Why 
guys has guns. Okay. We've killed him. Right. Here's the sodium chlorate box. classroom I believe. I search I can search the trash can. It's across the hall. I can even go in there. Nothing. This is so lame. This is yeah it's such a drag. Empty. Come on. Katie's? Oh. oh, Kate. Your locker looks so lonely. I do not. I know this room. This, this is, is like a scene in a horror film. Wait, I have something on his desk. Tape is mine. I should, yeah, tape. Only tape. three more items to go. Three more items? I haven't even seen anything. What the hell? We got like three items to go? What? I got tape. That's fucking it. I probably should find those items now. What do you think I'm trying to do, man? <laughs> okay. I got tape. Shit. Let's go across the hole. Wait, oh yeah, what's this? Artist, damn it, not a scientist. But this is so not sodium chlorate. Wait, was it not just in this room? I think I was just in this room. <laughs> yeah, skeleton. Okay, 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 okay. I found tape. That's all I fucking found. Are right, everybody in that room? That's a poster. I'm not looking hard enough. Behind the doors? I'm just looking behind the doors. You know, no. What's there? Oh, I already looked in there. There's no way it's a vending machine. Go to where? Ooh, sugar. Hey, not sugar. You're halfway home, Max. Here are the keys. None for the principal's office.
Uh, sugar. Tape and sugar I found. Wait, maybe go upstairs. I can't. I can't go upstairs. Okay, so all these items are downstairs. I can only look at this. Release the crack hand. Is that what I need? Is that what I needed? It's all mine anyway. Only one more ingredient left. Yeah, I can. One more left. What it? What that could be? Shit, I don't know. There's one more ingredient left. Got a fucking drink. Fire hydrant. No oh, shit. No. Oh, Maybe I'm overlooking. Maybe I'm overlooking. You deserve way more than this for taking on Nathan, but every little grade counts. <laughs> oh my god. Anything? No. That's just writing. There's one more thing I need. Is that, is that it? Science book? I didn't look at it. I can't take it. Oh man. This is... This is something else, bro. Max, if you can't find sodium chloride in the science lab, <laughs> give it up. Sodium? Sodium. Take yeah, this right. You know you're clumsy, Max. Don't waste your rewind power. Use the damn chair. Yes. This chair, indeed. Okay, we got it. Now it's time to show Chloe that Max is the bomb. Run! Run! Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Boom! Literally. Yes! Time to blow shit up! If you light the candle... This is so cool! Oh my god. Get ready to haul They're about ass. to blow it up, dude. Bro. bro, that's gonna wake up the whole That was so fucking cool. Oh, we are toast. Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department. Uh, so what should we do? I don't fucking know. Get in the fucking room. Run! Run! Shit! Shit! Do something, Max! I don't fucking know. <laughs> window! The window! Damn, I missed something. I better rewind. I'm stuck in the room. If I can get this bastard open, she can't cheat with her rewind. Oh, this is bullshit. Fuck you, door. Welcome to my domain. You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. The company I keep. Now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers only go so far. Man, I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy faux art crap. He must want everybody to know he has money. 
but no taste. How can you trust somebody who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? I'm glad I was expelled. Yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be at Blackwell. Eat me. I'm gonna pill for the papers on this ugly- Here guys, I'll be back. I gotta go piss. All right, I'm back. All right. Just my bad, y'all. Hang on. It's desk. There we go. Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair? This is your chance to truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock. Find us some clues about Rachel, or Kate, or Nathan. Anybody. I'm on the case. Why me? Look at this pile. Look at this pile. Tumbleweeds. Weird. This ass like I'm not going to read my own personal file. This file is going to be so spotless, I'll projectile vomit. I have to make sure Warren doesn't have a criminal background. Only two more files to go. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this. But there's not much here about the police investigate. Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Bad Chloe. Let's nab this last file, Sherlock. Always wanted to say nab. Wowzer. 
This will so not come in handy. I certainly can't use this. Looks like an oil painting spill. Awful. Look at this pile. Oh, I just looked at that. It's stupid. Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Bad Chloe. Okay, I found two files out of three. Okay. And nothing here. Dude, I know I shouldn't be going through the principal's files, but it's kind of cool. Just please don't accidentally delete his hard drive or anything. Like you can't rewind and fix it. I don't want to make it a habit, okay? Whatever, crackhead. You're hooked. Don't talk. Search. Oh, I like it when you get bossy. You're finally learning Look everywhere, possible. Max. There has to be some info in the student files. Tumbleweeds. to look. This pretty much sums up Kate. Shy and sweet. And in the wrong place. There I we think go. we found everything in here. I should go join Chloe now. Max, you better come check out these files. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus? And my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. Nathan Prescott III. Ooh, he's so money. And you know the Prescotts dropped major bank to bury Nathan's real file. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? The Prescotts always get their money's worth. Check out that note. Open it. It's just some crazy drawing. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. That's fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Whoa, listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. <sighs> it's pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we know he was all over Rachel, too. Oh, we are so going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info, let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know how you roll. We should definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Holy shit! Jackpot! Cha-ching! Wow, sir. That's a lot for the handicapped fund. Dude, there's $5,000 here. I could pay Frank back tonight. This will chill him out after you almost, you know, shot him. Are you gonna make a big issue out of this? Or just rewind and take the greenbacks for yourself? I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. So I could do... Frank knows things about Rachel, and he might talk if he's been paid, right? You are a supermax. And with the leftover dough, I'll take you on a road trip to Portland for the day. We'll stock up on tats, beer, weed, and donuts, and books from Powell's, and strip clubs. 
kidding. Oh god. What? Not you never know. Club. Oh hell no. I feel like shit for taking that money. That impish look scares me. Care for a midnight swim? The Blackwell pool is ours. Swimming? You want to take that risk now? It's been a cray week. We deserve a little mindless fun in the water. We're done for the night anyway. We're rich and nobody busted us. So? Splish splash? You're right. We hella deserve it. Splish splash. Did you actually just say hella? I think I'm a good bad influence on you. Hey, John, you there? So I'm just, I'm just going to leave the party. So we could just play at like 11. All right, I'm going to leave the party. Okay. Hang on. We're in the otter's lair. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? Even if I'm suspended. You can own this hellhole once you figure out your rewind power. Chloe is so psyched for girls night out, so I better follow her evil plan. Speak. Boys or girls? Girls, of course. Girls. Ooh la la. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. So, Victoria's secret is selfies. Go fuck your... No. Jefferson said, don't confuse art with the artist. These are cool shots. We could've got information about Nathan, Ashley. Dang. Looks like Brooke wants to go to the drive-in with Warren. Sorry, Rachel. 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 Okay, Rachel. Alright. She's 19. Missing. Currently missing. Max, try to find the light for the pool. I want to see the sharks. Otters don't like sharks. They bite. So do I. Hit that light! Oh my god. Light. Behind me? That's stupid. Uh, it's over here, right? Where is the light? God dang it. I'm stupid.
Looks like I'm the Vortex Club bouncer. Decisions, decisions. Oh, I'm sorry. Your names are not on the list. You'll have to eat shit now. Oh, for just one picture of their faces when they see my name. I need to put on the lights, I think. Hello, still waiting for the light. Hey. Where are the lights? I'm stupid, okay. Must be the lights. Probably, I don't know where the lights are. Unless I'm retarded. I guess I have to be retarded. I don't know. God. Hang on. Man, not the truth. Herself. For real, for real. I'm just too much of a stupid ass. Are they going here? There has to be a control panel for the lights around here. Oh. Oh, there you go. Oh my god, it's great. <laughs> Holy. Time to do or die, Max. What do I do? Oh yeah, baby, it feels like a hot tub. And with my cash dash, I'm queen of the world. Bow. Tell me you're not gonna stand there watching me like a zombie. Don't you dare! Come stop me, hippie. Okay, you asked for it. Cowabunga! Why look, an otter in my water. Dun 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 dun. You are so obvious. And I still get freaked out by that movie, so stop. I can't even watch any of those shark shows. <laughs> I'll just rewind and harpoon you. Otter's revenge. Cheater. Yeah, you wouldn't know about that. <laughs> I wish Rachel was here. She would totally love being in here at night. Wish you guys had met each other. We will. With all this stuff going on, I'm starting to think everything is related. And I want to find out why for Kate's sake. She didn't deserve to die. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. Thanks, girlfriend. You know what I mean. You're becoming like... This force of nature. More like luck of nature. Come on, my power failed trying to rescue Kate. 
Maybe I'm just stumbling back and forth in time. For what reason? You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. Not that time. But that's because you were there to kickstart my power. So it's time to start moving forward in time. And we're obviously connected, since without me you would have never discovered your power, right? Absolutely. You make me feel like I know what I'm doing. Then do you make me feel like I have a reason for still being in Arcadia Bay? I hope so. Stop being so goddamn humble. You're like the smartest, most talented person I've ever known. More than Rachel Amber? Dude, I'm not her groupie, okay? And I'm sure you have Blackwell bros all over you. Like Warren. Warren is... nice. <laughs> nice? Ouch. That means friend zone. No, he's really cool. It was so sweet when he stood up to Nathan. But I haven't told him about my rewind power. No worries. Once you get over yourself, you're gonna make the world bow. As long as you're there with me. Don't look so sad. I'm never leaving you. Now I'm getting cold in here. Because we're yapping instead of attacking each other, Otter versus Shark style. I uh, think I've had my pool experience for the year. Let's check. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. Gross. I feel like we just went swimming in Chlorine Bay. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Thanks. You would know. Hi! We have to go now! Like when we were kids. I could use my power, or just look for a hiding spot, or both. Where are they? Hello? Anybody there? Better not try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. Max, rewind now. Hello? Anybody there? Better not try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. I heard something over here. Who's here? I got I got a flashlight and a stick.
We are so invisible. Let's bail. Oh my lord. <laughs> my heart was beating. I'm not even kidding. Jesus Wait, God. Wait, turn around. They're coming. We have to find another way out. I think this is bullshit. You can't go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. You want me to crash where the Blackwell security officer lives so I'll be safe? Uh, okay. Into the car. Get in! Always remember this moment. Photo bomb. Photo hog. It feels like a different world from yesterday. We left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. Like it needs another one. I'd like to do something good for my school in Arcadia Bay. I can't even submit my photo to represent. I just don't want to be rejected. Every great artist gets rejected before they get accepted. So you have to enter a photo. Even though I'm pimping the school in town you want to torch? Come on, I don't want to see Arcadia Bay burn to the shore. I just say shit like that because I've been trying to get out of here since... since you left, basically. If I could find Rachel, then pay Frank off. I'm still leaving to start a whole new life. I wish we could just hang out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. No, you don't. You're suspended, criminal. Nobody suspended my homework. If I don't turn it in, the school will contact my folks again. And Max gets in more trouble.
Okay, time for some Chloe cosplay. Hey, there you go. Rachel left a bunch of her clothes with me. She's your size. But not quite my style. Max, you don't have a style yet. At least give it a try. You can always rewind back to your chlorine brand t-shirt and generic jeans. You suck. I like my shirt and jeans. But it would be cool to try on Rachel's clothes just to see if they fit. Stop second guessing yourself, Max. Put this on and let your inner punk rock girl come out. You can afford to take chances whenever and whatever you want to try. For example, I dare you to kiss me. What? I what? double dare you. Kiss me now. I'll see it. Damn, you're hardcore, Max. Now I can text Warren and tell him he doesn't stand a chance. Unless he's into girl and girl action. You're such a dork. Hey, she dared you. <laughs> that was priceless when I kissed Chloe. She didn't think I would. Looking sick, Max. A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, Shaka Bra? Maybe not. Go on down and say hi to Joyce. Free breakfast? I have to, uh, wake and bake first. I promise not to tell. Let's not rewind and find out, okay? Oh my god, that smells so amazing. It's like when we were... David, this is Officer Korn. Just want to let you know stepdaughter's car was identified near the Blackwell campus last night, around the time of the breaking. What? <sighs> Are you in trouble again, Chloe? Don't you sleep? What do I do? Message deleted. Goodbye, message. Wowzer, Chloe still eats the same cereal. So do I. I don't know what to do. How does she not see me? Good morning, Joyce. Rachel. Uh, uh, I mean, Max. Oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. Eggs and bacon all the way. Remember when you guys would sleep in until I yelled out, Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Totally. We'd wake up so fast. So this time you can help me with the ingredients. I need you to grab me the actual eggs and the bacon. I can handle eggs and bacon. I should evolve and become a vegan, but... Huh, <sighs> bacon. Come on, Max. Find those ingredients so we can chow down. What? I thought I had the ingredients. We need eggs. What ingredients? Oh, I'm stupid. The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. 
water. I got you the eggs. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but... We are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. Is there any reason that Rachel might be mad at Chloe and left without her? Chloe could piss everybody off but her. They were almost joined at the head. Reminded me of you and Chloe. But Rachel wasn't as grounded as you. I'm grounded? Since when? Maybe that's why Chloe likes Rachel so much. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? What? <laughs> No way. I know I was selfish when I left. I'm glad Chloe found a better friend. No, just a different one. Last time I saw you and Chloe in your pirate outfits, I knew she would never find a better friend. And when you took the rap for that joint, you proved it. Thanks. But it seems like Chloe and me were pirates a thousand years ago. And that makes me what, a century old? <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, youth. If only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila, a breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> go sit at the table. Uh, table. Thank you so much, Joyce. I'm never leaving this table. Good, you can clean. Okay. That looks good, bro. I don't know why that makes me ugly. Bring those eggs and bacon to my belly. Can I get up now? I guess nobody waters the plant here. Seeing you again, ah, oh, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. Wow, sir. I totally remember that day. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this, and... and... I know, Joyce. I'm sorry. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, positive, and everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? It's not always about you. Chloe, please, it's too early to start picking a fight. Heed instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Uh, no one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me. 
I have to use the bathroom. Sure, run off and pee when you should back me up. Now who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. One I need. do need to get into David's computer. Okay. He's gotta be hiding shit. No shit it needs a password. How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. Clues? Okay. Nothing to see here. Well, of course. I remember looking there on episode one. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. Stepdad? Okay. Try stepdad. Date. Obviously, David's parents care about him. That date might be a good password. Mom and dad. Worst hacker ever. No way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. Naturally, David would buy a heavy-duty military padlock. I can even see the combination. That might be a useful password. Okay. Yep, locked up. I can't enter any password. Shit. No! Nothing in it. The one? Uh. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. Try again. Such wrong. No way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. Oh. Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. Even David Madsen might be an angel to somebody else. Okay. Is it about the knife? Maybe it's about the knife. Okay. Magic eight ball says no. <laughs> How am I supposed to know?
No. Back quit. Oh, let, me just, let me just do that. Alright. Drawler? I could try the license number for the password. So I'll be in personal, right? Yeah. Personal. No, it's not personal. Family? No. Army. No. Yeah, army. Oh, shit balls. Bro, I don't know what the password is. Maybe. For any clues. I looked on the paylock. I looked in there. I. The drawer? Together. Drawer. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. Oh, this. David has been dragging his head around since 2001. That's personal? Yeah. Worst hacker ever. No way, Max. You told uh, me to the laptop. Where? How the fuck am I supposed to figure this shit out, man? Shot everything. Literally. Look at the fucking knife. Oh, look. the bag. That's all I do. That's search. cute. Could be a password here. Thing is, I locked the shit out, so. Fucking reset, so. That should be a family, right? I think it's a family. No, it's not a family. Personal? No. Army. Bruh. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait. Yeah, that's his, that is family. I don't think I checked the bag. That's cute. Could be a password here. Just yet. I already tried stepdad. Those two doesn't work. That does not work. Keep. Oh, six or seven. Nope. <laughs> oh no. How the fuck am I supposed to know this? I could try the license number for the password. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. I still need to find the password to David's computer. Thing is, we looked everywhere. David has been dragging his head around since 2001. I looked in there. I looked in there. 
Uh, look in the book. I did, but... Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? Oh, shit. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. I looked at the tape, I looked Cute. at this. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. Fucking do. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. That's what I did. Nothing in it. Ah. Oh. There's no way Chloe can put that gun back now. I still need to find the password to David's computer. What do you think I've been trying to do? I literally looked at everything. Hmm. Maybe there's something else in the back? That's cute. Could be a password here. I looked in an eye. Now the car looks ready to roll. This is a better hobby for David than surveillance. I already searched this shit. The attic? Wait, what? No. Stupid. No. There's one more missing passcode. So we need that last passcode. Obviously, David's parents care about him. That... Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. I already looked at this. Let's That's look cute. At everything. Could be a password here. Nothing there. Even David Madsen might be an angel to somebody else. Okay. Uh, search that. Just in case, I'll search it again just in case. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. That might be a useful password. Wait. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. All I had to do is just look back. Thank you. Knocks the hacker strikes again. Whoa, spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. But why does David care? Instead of stalking Kate, David could have helped her. This is so wrong. Oh, creepy bastard. Damn. I better tell Chloe about this now. Ugh, it's just one I more thing to make her sad and mad.
Nice breakfast. David, you, you back already? I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. What happened? Some little shit-ass punks broke into the swimming pool. This is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the campus. Do you know for sure it was Blackwell students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. <sighs> Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? You know more about her than me. Must be nice to be suspended and have some free time off Blackwell. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras, so he can spy on everybody. Like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not now, Chloe. He used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? You're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even threatened me. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Uh, you were smoking pot in Chloe's room. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? Is this true, Max? Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I find this very disturbing. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Oh, you're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. Well, screw you. David, you better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You can't kick me out of my own home. It's my home, David. Paid for and in my name. You know the law, right? Oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm outflanked. Have a nice day. Chloe, for once, just please shut up. I hope Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. I don't want to... <coughs> Max, that gave me chills. And you better not rewind this one. Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not going to believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that going to prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything for his sake. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shipples. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then Stop you come in and rewind so Frank balls. doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. Locked. 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 <laughs> locked. Locked. We gotta get, we gotta get, we gotta get. Okay. I'll 
look at those messages later. What the hell is this? Ah, oh, gross. Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Good morning. How are the fish today? Don't ask. First the snow, then an eclipse. What's next? A tornado? I hope not. Could be worse. We could get one of those California quakes. True. Well, I'm California feeling a little dizzy quakes. now. <laughs> hope you catch the big one today. I better. Too late to switch careers now. See you around, kid. Oh. Oh. Tornadoes, snowfall, eclipses, now dying animals? Holy shit. Oh. Another fucking dead bird. Dooba 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 dooba. Oh. I guess Kate Marsh will be the face of Blackwell for a while. Such a waste. Ugh. Awful. Oh. What can I do for you, Max? I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over Arcadia Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago. So I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I could get one instant replay in life. I better finish my breakfast first. We'll chat later, Max. I shouldn't have said that. I'll need to rewind. You eat like a pig. Try the floor. I was eating those beans. Are you fucking insane? I was eating those beans!
God, this person's crazy. Try to hit a fucking woman. God damn. I just wanted to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> okay. What I do? Go back outside? No reason to go now. No reason to go now. No need to go there now. Talk to him. You show up after almost shooting me? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. The fuck do you want? Could I get you to drop Chloe's debt? Are you supposed to be a smart student? You'll find out if you do me this favor. Thanks, Godmother. But I don't need your favors. And Chloe doesn't get any from me. <coughs> what the fuck now? <coughs> How you doing, Maxine? I'm so sorry you had to be up there with Kate when she, you know... Just know that we're proud of you for going up there. Thanks, Officer Barry. I know you guys deal with this stuff way more than me, but it is hard to deal with. I'm glad you're representing Blackwell Academy. I feel like David Madsen represents Blackwell. Not for long. He's a loose cannon. We all respect him for his service, but he's too eager. He's eager to be a dick to me and Chloe. That's true. He was ranting about a stolen gun, then I tuned out. Somebody's always out to get him. What can I do for you, Max? Well, I heard a rumor you were working for the Prescott family on the side. Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? I don't blame you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Max. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. What the fuck now? Turn up the brain to 11, Max. How can you snag Frank's keys? I don't know. Maybe we all did. Shit. What are the other signs then? No reason to go now. <sighs> Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh... Oh look! Max Amber. Is that your punk rock girl outfit now that you've been suspended? You're already in enough trouble with David Madsen. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. No worries, because you're the one trying to fake it till you make it. At least you were smart enough to keep your big mouth shut in the principal's office. Listen, Nathan. I'll take back everything I said about you. If you hook me up with Frank. Know what I mean? You look like you've never even taken a hit of baby aspirin. How do you think I stay wired all night studying? So is it a deal or not? Calm down, hard up. Deal. 
You know, get your school supplies. Just go over to Frank and whisper, higher education. You'll hook your ass up. What the fuck now? By the way, Frank, I was wondering if you had any, um, higher education. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. Do you want the after-school special to go with that? <laughs> Jesus. Look, I don't sell anything but bottles to feed me and my dog. I work for a living. Not like you spoiled Blackwell punks with too much time on your hands. But... But nothing. Don't ever ask me for anything ever again. Ever. And I'll back off. Get a new outfit. And leave me alone. Damn, I really pissed him off. I need to go back. No reason to go now. You need to go back. Get a new outfit. And leave me alone. Get a new outfit. I shouldn't have said leave that. Leave me alone. I'll need to rewind. I shouldn't have said that. I'll need to rewind. Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh... Oh look! Max Amber. Is that your punk rock girl outfit now that you've been suspended? You're already in enough trouble with David Madsen. Your sugar daddy will always protect you. And threaten me. You don't know shit about my father or me. Nobody here does. Then tell me what I should know. Why? So you can pretend to care, hmm? Spoiler alert, he's an asshole! Maybe I could help you. I don't need you for anything except to stay out of my fucking business, understand? Now get out of my face! Mm, holy shit, what do you want now? I heard your dad hired a local cop to keep an eye out on you and Frank Bowers. Like a babysitter. Bullshit! My dad doesn't hire. He owns. And these pigs know better than to knock on me. Do they? I hope that means Frank won't get busted. Eventually, he will. Guy's into some freaky shit. He told me once he took a weird blood oath for Rachel. Uh, forget I told you that. Seriously. Now get off my crack, whore. Keep your pie holes shut. Uh, report that to the police. How you doing, Maxine? Thanks, Officer Barry. I know you... I'm... You show up after almost shooting me? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. The fuck do you want? Could I get you to drop Chloe's debt? Or are you supposed? By the way, Frank, I was wondering if you had any, um. <laughs> but. But nothing. Okay. Are you fucking stupid? Get out of my space. I shouldn't have said that. I need to rewind.
drugs for sale, your father, Kate Marsh. I bet you hoped that Kate Marsh would stay quiet. Idiot says what? Did you drug her? You are so stupid, Max. You think you're so goddamn smart, too. Don't push me, girl. You don't want me for an enemy, understand? Do you? Calm down, dude. We're in the diner. Right. Plus, you're an adult now. I can sue your dumbass for libel. Thanks. Now fuck off, Dyke. Nathan and Frank together? That's a bad combo. You eat like a pig. No! But I meant to speak to him. I'm so stupid. What's the deal? My brain's burned. My brain is caught. Do I talk to the police officer? How you doing, Maxine? I'm so sorry you had to be up there with Kate when she, you know, just know that we're proud of you for going up there. Thanks, officer. I'm glad you're representing Blackwell Academy. Do you think Arcadia Bay is a weird town? I'd take a normal city with normal problems about now. It makes me sick thinking about it. Well, I heard a rumor you were working for the press. Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? I don't blame you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Max. Rachel! I bet Frank hooked you and Rachel Amber up with party supplies. Nice try. Rachel partied like a fiend on her own. More than me. I doubt that. Like you would know, virgin. Even that pig over there knows Rachel hung out more with Frank. I mean, don't talk to the cop about that, dumbass. What can I do for you, Max? Nathan said that Rachel Amber represents Blackwell, with Frank Bowers. Bowers ain't no student anymore. Sadly, he does represent one side of Arcadia Bay. I want you to stay out of his orbit, okay? He man that rabid mutt. I heard something about Frank Bowers and his puppy. My boy does love his dog. Especially when the dog is your personal drooling bodyguard. You can bet he trained that poor thing on blood. Gross. I wouldn't bet. Where did he get the pup? Frank used to bet on dog fights. Now, to his credit, he had a revelation and he saved a bunch of the dogs, kept one for himself. He's still a creep. You and that Chloe stay away, right? So now do I go back to her? Holy shit, what do you want now? Weren't you supposed to keep your mouth shut about the blood oath Frank took for Rachel? Blood oath? Who? What the fuck? I never told anybody about that freaky shit. Besides, everybody knows Frank is a liar and a loser. Even Rachel did. Yet Rachel Amber hung out with him more than you. So? Rachel wanted Frank's stash. She let him take pictures, then he carries around her photo like she posed for love. Dumbass. Uh, go back to the cop now, or...? What can I do for you, Max? Okay. I think I go to Frank now. You act so scary, but... You did save all those dogs. One, I'm not acting. Two, who told you about the dogs? It's actually a great story. 
You're an animal lover. Could I pet the doggy? I could go grab him from your RV right now. <laughs> I won't even let you pick up the dog shit. Besides, you don't want a leash. You want these keys right here. Look at your eyes dilate. You're worse than a junkie, Max. But no fix for you. I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now! He brought. Now back to Chloe. Oh. Perfect. Holy crap, man! Are you shitting me? I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Frank. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. <sighs> On your mark, get set. Throw! <laughs> get the treat, treat boy. The meat is in the street. Please do not let that poor dog be hit. I bet he's fine. I'm sure he is. Come on, we definitely don't have time to waste now. Oh, please, please don't let that dog be hurt. The worst. Damn, I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy! Can you see us heading down the coast to Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you'd probably want me to kiss you again. Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. I know. Daydreaming. They definitely like each other, don't they? You scope oh. the area while I hack his computer for info. Good to know Frank has a knife lying around. Frank is almost a made for TV hoarder. This place is nasty. No prize here. As expected. Crappy Wi-Fi out here. It's taking days to download the porn. Yuck. Uh. Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. Like what? Uh. Blowtorch? No. That's fucking stupid. I could pry this vent open with the right tool. What? No more secrets.
Ooh, Frank's stash. So what could open the vent? The knife? This is almost as good as a set of keys. Yeah. Knife to open the vent. My blade will open any portal. Yes, sir. Oh, man. Rachel and Frank's dog. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. I'm glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. Hmm. Trouble in paradise. Maybe I can open this vent, right? Where's, where did a knife go? Okay, maybe I got the information already. Maybe I need... It makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years, my mother gloms on the step fucker, now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit! Who hasn't? Fuck everybody! Chloe! Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. It's just life. Shit happens. It's nobody's fault. Blah, 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 as Mr. Jefferson would say. And, and Kate Marsh... Yes, Kate Marsh killed herself. She's dead. Such sad, okay? That doesn't make me feel better about my fucked up life, get it? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? David? You blame David? I said my dad. My real father, who got himself killed for nothing. Not the human placeholder for Joyce. Chloe, your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. You don't want to hear this, but you're still here, alive, with me, and that is no accident. You're right. I don't want to hear this. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me, and Rachel needs you.
She's pissed off. Is that them back in the past? Oh my crazy. Shit, I don't fucking know. Just point your Oh my god. What is happening now? She has another superpower? He's Alan Arn to put this. Okay. Someday Dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. That's Not nice. until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Max, tell him. Whoa, hey. You look totally pale. Are you okay? Yeah. I just... Uh... Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, Chloe. Give me the thumbs up or thumbs down. Well... I might just allow this one into the family album. You're the boss. What is this? But not the cook. William is here. Hands, Daddy. Yes, and we can't Chloe is just a kid. And serve us slackers. Am I that far back, back in time? You mean pancakes? Go back in time. In France, they call them. Crazy. I'm 18 what? years old what? inside my 13-year-old self. If you want to eat. How? We. Oui. I volunteer to break the eggs. Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. That's true. So, how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? Oh my god, it's so pretty. I am, when your mom is Look away. Note. Joyce loves William so much. I'll let her know that. Man, I remember Chloe reading this, but not after today. Okay. Serial, same old, same old. Uh, another magazine. Chloe was so into manga. Nice hair. That's why she made her hair like that, probably. Am I right, or...? What a mess we made. I remember those cool drawings I did with Chloe. Hello. Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. I forgot about this. Back to the lighthouse. Day trip to the lighthouse. This sketch is for you to always remember about Chloe. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get Oh, yeah. I miss movie nights here. Cookies and popcorn. Be there shortly. Love you. I have to stop William from taking his car today. Ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. You are upon. ridiculous. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where am I going? I know they never took that big vacation. Keys. That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please.
What do I do now? Aha! Uh -huh. You can't hide from me forever. Obvious, but it will have to do. Play nice. Try not to destroy too much of the house. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. What? I have to try. I have to. I, I was put here to use this power to save William. For Chloe. Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. That's I know I've seen those pictures before. Wait. How many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right. Like you're the real cook here? I am. When your mom is away. I'll let her know that. I'm gonna do some more. Uh, Mr. Price, in case you're thinking about using your car, I heard there's awful traffic and road construction, so you shouldn't drive at all. Max, you are the road warrior. I promise, if I have to go anywhere, I'll drive like I'm taking a test. Fair enough? Not really. I just know the roads are bad and stuff, so... So you... Since you're obviously my personal GPS, I feel safer already. So don't look so worried, Max. Sorry, wrong number. Max, come on, you know better than that. Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two whales. What? Oh, Thanks I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast on. You are upon. ridiculous. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the Chloe was so into manga. You nice hair. College fund. Keys, please. Maybe it's the same right here. How do I... Aha! You can't hide from me forever. Now lock up after I leave. Play nice. Try not to destroy too much no. of the house. Don't and leave. no Chloe and Mac. Okay, so I need to hide the keys. Okay, so I want to. Okay. I think I know what to do now. Mom said it depends. Score! So, how okay. many eggs? Don't keys. you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am. When your mom is away, I'll let her know that. So, I just need to get the keys in my hand. Is that what I have to do? Sorry, wrong number. Max, Dang come it. on, you know better than that. Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course, I'll come pick you up. Perfect. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. You are upon. ridiculous. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Shit. 
shit. Where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. I knew this thing would come in handy. How did my keys get in here? And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world-famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. I have to try. I have to. I, I was put here to use this power to save William. For Chloe. Owl, dude, I'm trying. Okay, so I already have the keys. Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. That's true. So, how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am, when your mom is away. I'll let her know that. Boom! Disconnected. Perfect. Okay. Hey, honey. I, I have no idea why the home phone didn't ring just now. I'm just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Maybe Love you. Get in this way. I don't know. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. <laughs> You are ridiculous. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. I knew this thing would come in. Oh, Chloe and Mac. Could I just keep the keys? So I, remember how many eggs. I need to hide the keys where William won't. Boom. Disconnected. So how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am. When your mom is away, I'll let her know that. Uh, Mr. Price, in case you're thinking about using your car, I heard there's. Listen, don't let your dad take his car today. I know it sounds weird, but please believe me. Something terrible is going to happen. You have to stop him from driving anywhere. Whatever, weirdo. What kind of thing is that to say about my dad? I'm not joking. Then you stop him, Supermax. Hey, honey. I have no idea why the home phone didn't ring just now. I'm just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. <laughs> You are ridiculous. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please.
Hey, honey. I, I have no idea why the home phone didn't ring just now. I'm just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Uh... Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. <laughs> you are ridiculous. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Get it this way. Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. I knew this thing would come in handy. How did my keys get in here? And no clue. I don't know how. I swear. Okay. Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. That's true. So, how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right. Like you're the real cook here? Boom! Disconnected. I'll let her know that. Hey, honey. I, I have no idea why the home phone didn't ring just now. I'm just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe. Chloe and Max, we're all going to... Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. Boom! Disconnected. So, how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am when your mom is away. I'll let her know that. Listen, don't let your dad take his car today. I know it sounds weird, but please believe me. Something terrible is going to happen. You have to stop him from driving anywhere. Whatever, weirdo. What kind of thing is that to say about my dad? I'm not joking. Then you stop him, Supermax. Uh, Mr. Price, in case you're thinking about using your car, I heard there's awful traffic and road construction, so you shouldn't drive at all. Max, you are the road warrior. I promise, if I have to go anywhere, I'll drive like I'm taking a test. Fair enough? Not really. I just know the roads are bad and stuff, so... So you... Since you're obviously my personal GPS, I feel mm. safer already. So don't look so worried, Max. Now I get to take a picture. Strike a pose. Make me a star. Just make me look young. Hey, honey. I, I have no idea why the home phone didn't ring just now. I'm just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. <laughs> you are ridiculous. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Obvious, but it will have to do. Oh. Shit. 
shit. Where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. Uh. I knew this thing would come in handy. How did my keys get in here? And no Chloe and Max. How in the world? We'll be here all night, man. How the fuck would my supposed to do this? Oh. Okay. Do you remember so how many eggs? eggs? Mom said it depends. That's true. So, how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right. Like you're the real cook here? I am. When you're Boom. Mom's Disconnected. I'll let her know that. Uh, Mr. Price, all right, all right, in all right, case right. you're thinking about using your car, I heard there's awful traffic and road construction, so you where, shouldn't where drive. What if I have the keys? Max, you are the road warrior. I promise, if I have to go anywhere, I'll drive like I'm taking a test. Fair enough? Not really. I just know the roads are bad and stuff, so. So you since you're obviously my personal GPS, I feel safer already. So don't look so worried, Max. I can't speak to her anymore. I I'm hey, just gonna keep the keys. I, I have no idea why the home phone didn't ring just now. I'm just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Okay. Of course I'll come. I'm just going to keep the keys. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there right. shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. <laughs> you are ridiculous. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. The fact that I can't go upstairs, if I'm able to go upstairs, maybe you will find him. All right, get ready, where are those boy? keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. Max, this is not the best time for a prank. Keys, please. Uh, I was just, um, are you sure Joyce is ready? Uh, let's just, let's just wait. I, um, uh, sorry. Here. I'll get you back someday. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad. <laughs> I don't know how to beat this. I'm suffering, man. Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. Boom. That's true. Disconnected. So how many eggs? Okay. Don't you dare question the chef. Right. Like you're the real cook here. I am when your mom is away. I'll let her know that. I got 30 keys. Perfect. God, I know why I have is my brain right so here? stupid? I I'm so stupid, y'all. Forgot all about you, little buddy. Release the keys. 
Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics. You can take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh yeah, the bus is great. It comes every 15 minutes and there'll be plenty of room for you and, and joys and groceries and, and it'll save the environment. You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? All my friends in LA told me that Oregon was Max. Be wet and cold every day. But Never like Maxine. So that's why she was laughing so hard. I know, sorry, Mad Is Max. <laughs> You're not pissed at me, right? Right? No, Do you want to go hit the girls' potty and smoke them peace pipe? I think Max is hot. She's acting like so weird. You cool, Max? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, you don't want anybody in the club. Like whatever, bitch. Warren, he hooked up with Stella? Oh no, this is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Chloe.
That's it for episode three, y'all. Oh my lord. That's in the books. Oh, it's a strip club. Oh, oh that's gonna be on episode four. I already played episode one, two, and three, uh, four and five. Uh, I don't know if it'll be tomorrow. It might be tomorrow. I don't know. But I hope you guys enjoy the stream. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe. Please do that for me. I would appreciate it. And I'll see you guys in the next stream. Love you guys. Peace out, man.